in the small, seemingly peaceful American town of Willow Creek. Carol and Mark Thompson's everyday life seemed to be on track. Carol, a dedicated housewife and mother of two, and Mark, a successful businessman, were a respected and beloved couple in the community. The Thompson family home, with its manicured garden and impeccable facade, was a symbol of the American dream realized. However, beneath the surface of this perfect life, an unexpected and dangerous connection was about to form. Edna, Carol's mother-in-law, was a woman known for her exemplary attitude and local influence. Widowed for several years, Edna maintained an active social life and was admired for her strength and dedication to her family. His relationship with Carol had always been cordial but superficial, marked by occasional meetings and polite interactions. It all started discreetly and innocently. Edna, who spent more and more time at the Thompson house to help with the children and offer emotional support to Carol, began to grow closer to her daughter-in-law. The first notable change was the frequency of meetings. Whereas before Edna only visited the house sporadically, now she was present almost every day, offering help with household chores and spending time with Carol and the children. This growing closeness seemed natural to other family members who saw Edna as a caring grandmother and supportive figure. The bond between Carol and Edna, however, began to deepen in unexpected ways. Conversations between the two women became more personal and intimate, with Carol sharing her frustrations and insecurities with Edna. She felt overwhelmed by the responsibilities of being a mother and wife and looked to Edna for a listening ear and wise counsel. Edna, in turn, offered empathy and understanding, creating a sense of emotional connection that Carol craved. Over time, this close friendship evolved into something deeper. In a moment of vulnerability, Carol revealed to Edna feelings and desires that she had never shared with anyone. Edna, upon hearing these confessions, began to offer more than comfort. She began to become a source of desire and emotional comfort for Carol. The relationship that began as emotional support became an intense exchange of attention and affection. The first meeting that went beyond the limits of friendship was marked by a moment of desperation and need. Carol, struggling to cope with the pressure in her life, sought out Edna for a late-night chat after an argument with Mark. The meeting, initially planned as a conversation to vent, quickly turned into a moment of unexpected intimacy. The two emotionally overwhelmed women found comfort in each other in ways they had not anticipated. This first act of intimacy was the starting point for a secret and passionate relationship. As the relationship between Carol and Edna deepened, the need to keep the secret became a constant concern. Both women were aware of the possible social and personal repercussions of their affair. Carol feared that her family life would be destroyed and that her reputation would be tarnished, while Edna feared that her behavior could compromise her standing in the community and her relationship with her family. Secret meetings between Carol and Edna became a regular part of their lives. To avoid suspicion, they met in discreet locations and at times when they knew their families would be busy or absent. The fear of being discovered increased the intensity and frequency of their encounters. The need to keep the secret and the growing desire between the two women fueled a cycle of tension and excitement that was difficult to control. However, the secret came at a significant emotional cost. The weight of maintaining the perfect facade and the constant pressure to hide the truth began to take a toll on both of their mental health. Carol and Edna found themselves struggling to balance their public and private lives, while fear and guilt grew each day. The apparent perfection of the Thompsons' lives was about to be torn apart by a dangerous and devastating secret. The beginning of this secret reveals how Beneath the surface of normality, the most complex and dangerous of human relationships can hide. The relationship between Carol and Edna not only challenged their own lives and values, but also threatened to destabilize the family and social core that they had both tried to protect. As the relationship between Carol and Edna deepened, the emotional and psychological impact on both women began to manifest itself more clearly. What began as a seemingly innocent connection between two women had now turned into an intense, forbidden bond. 
fraught with conflicting emotions and a constant sense of imminent danger. Carol, a dedicated housewife, found in Edna not only a confidant, but a source of escapism from her daily responsibilities and the constant stress of her family life. Mark, her husband, was always busy with his work, and the times Carol spent with him became less frequent and increasingly superficial. The attention and affection that Edna offered filled a growing void in Carol's life. The emotional gratification Carol experienced in conversations and encounters with Edna quickly turned into emotional dependence, and the line between comfort and desire began to blur. Edna, in turn, saw her relationship with Carol as a way to regain the feeling of youth and vitality that she felt she had lost with age. The closeness and intimacy they shared gave Edna a sense of relevance and being wanted, something she didn't often experience. This new dynamic gave Edna a way to feel alive and valued, which motivated her to keep the secret and prolong the affair. The increased frequency of secret meetings was a deliberate attempt to intensify the emotional and physical connection between the two women. Carol and Edna found ways to meet in discreet locations, such as out-of-town hotels and temporarily rented apartments. These meetings were carefully planned to ensure there was no suspicion from family or neighbors. The adrenaline of keeping the affair hidden added a layer of excitement to the relationship transforming each encounter into an event filled with tension and anticipation. The secret, however, was beginning to weigh more heavily on Carol and Edna. The constant need to maintain the facade of a perfect family life became an increasingly difficult burden to bear. Carol struggled to balance her responsibilities as a mother and wife with the desire and passion she felt for Edna. The constant lies and manipulations to cover up his encounters were wearing down his emotional state. She felt increasing guilt and shame, which manifested in anxiety attacks and sleepless nights. Edna, although initially perceived as someone in control of the situation, was also beginning to feel the adverse effects of keeping the secret. The pressure to protect her reputation and standing in the community was creating a level of stress she had never experienced before constant worry about the possibility of exposure and guilt over deceiving his family began to erode his confidence and peace of mind. Edna was becoming increasingly isolated, avoiding social gatherings and distancing herself from friends and family to avoid any possibility of being discovered. The growing intensity of the affair began to generate more conflicts between Carol and Edna. Discussions about how to deal with secrecy and frequency of meetings had become increasingly common. The two women found themselves in a cycle of emotional ups and downs, where pleasure and desire mixed with anxiety and fear. The relationship, which had previously been an escape, had now become a source of constant tension and insecurity. The escalation of the relationship also began to affect family dynamics in a more subtle way. Mark began to notice that something was wrong with Carol, noticing her increasing irritability and emotional withdrawal. He had no idea the true nature of Carol's problems, but he felt there was a growing distance between them. The tensions Carol faced at home contributed to a feeling that her world was falling apart, which in turn intensified her desire to seek comfort from Edna. The complexity of the situation was deepening as Carol and Edna found themselves increasingly embroiled in a web of lies and manipulation. The weight of keeping the secret was beginning to deeply affect their lives and their ability to deal with everyday reality. The affair, which had begun as a form of escapism, was now shaping every aspect of their lives in painful and disturbing ways. As the secret relationship between Carol and Edna became more intense and complex, the breaking point inevitably approached. The pressure of keeping the affair hidden combined with growing guilt and fear of exposure, was placing an unbearable emotional burden on both women. What began as an escape from personal frustrations was about to trigger a devastating disaster. The growing tension between Carol and Edna began to manifest itself in several ways. Meetings, which were once marked by a sense of euphoria and pleasure, were now becoming emotional battlegrounds. Carol was increasingly restless and stressed, reflecting the constant pressure of secrecy and concealment in her everyday life. The relationship, 
which had once seemed like a romantic getaway, was now turning into a source of constant anxiety and fear. Carol felt distressed by the growing need to hide the truth, which made her question her own sanity. Edna, on the other hand, was dealing with increasing despair. His concern about the possibility of his affair being discovered was becoming an obsession. The constant need to maintain a perfect facade, coupled with the fear of losing his reputation and standing in the community, was eroding his inner peace. Edna began to isolate herself socially, avoiding meetings and events to reduce the risk of anyone discovering any clues about her behavior. His social and family life was being sacrificed in favor of maintaining the secret. The breaking point began to form when a series of events culminated in an episode of absolute despair. The relationship between Carol and Edna was in a state of constant tension, with frequent arguments about how to deal with the secret and the fear that someone might find out. In a particularly distressing moment, Edna received an anonymous message threatening to reveal her affair if she didn't pay a large sum of money. This unknown blackmailer exploited Edna's vulnerability and her need to protect her reputation. The threat of exposure triggered a deep panic in Edna. She not only feared for her reputation, but also for the impact the revelation would have on her family and Carol's life. The fear of being discovered led her to consider desperate options to protect her secret. Edna began to feel trapped, and the feeling of not having a way out caused a significant emotional breakdown. She found herself in a state of despair that affected her ability to make rational decisions. The tension came to a head one fateful night. Carol and Edna had planned a meeting in a secluded location to discuss the blackmail threat and seek a solution. The meeting, however, was marked by an intense discussion and an emotional confrontation. Edna, consumed by guilt and fear, began to lose her calm, while Carol felt increasingly helpless and overwhelmed. The confrontation quickly turned into an extremely emotionally charged moment. In a fit of panic and despair, Edna made a drastic decision. Tension and fear mix in a moment of lack of control, leading her to an act of brutal violence. In a fit of rage and fear, Edna committed a shocking murder, killing Carol in an impulsive and cruel act. The crime was the result of a series of repressed emotions and a desperate attempt to protect his secret at any cost. The murder was a devastating blow to both the community and Carol and Edna's family. The brutal act left everyone in shock and began an investigation that sought to understand the motivations and circumstances that led to the crime. The breaking point in Carol and Edna's relationship not only sealed Carol's fate, but also triggered a series of events that would lead to the exposure of the secret and the destruction of the lives of everyone involved. The final rupture revealed the fragility of human emotions and the extreme limits people can go to when faced with fear and guilt. Carol's murder marked the climax of a deeply disturbing relationship, where desire and desperation mixed to create a devastating tragedy. After Carol's brutal murder, shock and confusion gripped the small community of Willow Creek. Carol Thompson's death was an unexpected and devastating event that left her family, friends, and neighbors in a state of bewilderment. The police began a detailed investigation to discover the circumstances that led to the crime and understand the reasons behind Edna's brutal act. The investigation began with collecting evidence at the crime scene. The murder scene, a temporary apartment where Carol and Edna had met to discuss the blackmail threat, was thoroughly analyzed by the investigation team. Police found clear evidence of an intense fight, including signs of physical aggression and broken objects. The presence of traces of blood and marks of struggle suggested that the crime was not an isolated act, but rather the result of a violent confrontation. Investigators began questioning people close to the case, including Carol's husband Mark and other family members and friends. Mark devastated by the loss of his wife, was in a state of shock and had difficulty processing the reality of what had happened. Their accounts of Carol's recent behavior, her increasing detachment, and her emotional changes were carefully analyzed. Although Mark had no clear suspicions about Edna's involvement, the police began to notice discrepancies in the stories and behaviors of those close to Carol. Police also sought to understand deeper family relationships and dynamics. The relationship between Carol and Edna, which initially seemed innocent, 
began to reveal itself as a crucial factor in the investigation. Authorities discovered that Edna had had several secret meetings with Carol before the murder, but the exact nature of these meetings was initially unclear. Investigators began tracking communication between Edna and Carol, looking for any evidence of planning or premeditation. During the investigation, additional clues emerged about Edna's involvement. The police received an anonymous tip about possible blackmail, which was directly related to the case. The threat from an unknown blackmailer, who had asked for a large sum of money in exchange for not revealing the affair, began to make sense. The messages and emails exchanged between Edna and the blackmailer were tracked, revealing the magnitude of the pressure Edna was facing. This emotional pressure and the imminent threat of exposure had contributed significantly to Edna's state of despair. Investigators also searched Edna's home, where they found more evidence linking Edna to the crime. Among the items found were personal notes and messages that demonstrated his emotional state and concern about the situation. The police were able to obtain a partial confession from Edna, in which she admitted to having committed the crime, but claimed to have acted under intense panic and desperation. As the details of the investigation unfolded, the truth about the affair between Edna and Carol began to emerge. Police were able to establish a direct line between the murder and the two women's secret relationship. Documents and communication records show the extent of the relationship and the impact it had on Edna. The evidence suggested that the murder was an impulsive and desperate act, resulting from a series of repressed emotions and fear of exposure. The case received widespread media coverage and the revelation of the affair shocked the community. The exposure of the intimate secret and the brutal nature of the crime were a scandal for the town of Willow Creek, which had never witnessed a tragedy of this magnitude. Edna's trial was a highly publicized event where details of the case were exposed to the public. The narrative of betrayal and despair has become a widely discussed topic, reflecting on the limits of the human condition and the consequences of keeping devastating secrets. The investigation and revelation of the secret showed how, beneath the surface of everyday life, the darkest and most disturbing aspects of human relationships can lurk. Carol and Edna's story became a tragic example of how desire, guilt, and despair can culminate in acts of violence and destruction. The small town of Willow Creek was forever marked by the tragedy and the emotional complexity it revealed. Edna's trial was a landmark event that captured media and community attention, highlighting the profound impact the case had on everyone involved. The shocking nature of the crime and complex emotional context generated intense public interest, and the courtroom became the stage for a legal and emotional drama that exposed the depths of the tragedy. The courtroom was packed on the day of the first hearing. The room was full of journalists, family members, and onlookers, all eager to follow the development of the case. Edna, who had already been identified as the main suspect, sat in the dock with an expression of despair and regret. The first-degree murder charge was being formally filed, and the defense was preparing its strategy for dealing with the serious charges. The prosecutor presented the case in detail, tracing the path that led to the murder. The evidence was presented meticulously, including testimony from forensic experts who analyzed the crime scene and the evidence collected. The narrative of how the secret relationship between Edna and Carol culminated in an act of violence was exposed in detail, demonstrating how much the affair had contributed to the tragedy. Defense lawyers tried to argue that Edna acted in a state of panic and desperation, which led to impulsive and violent behavior. They argued that constant fear of exposure and blackmail pushed her into an unstable mental state, making her unable to act rationally. The defense presented testimony from mental health experts to support their claim that Edna was under extreme stress and psychological distress. The trial brought to light intimate and disturbing details of the relationship between Edna and Carol. Messages exchanged between the two women were read in court, exposing the intensity and complexity of the affair. Discussions about blackmail and threats were detailed, showing how the fear of being discovered had contributed to the escalation of the situation. The revelation of how Edna tried to protect her reputation and keep the secret ended up highlighting how desperate and broken she had become. Key witnesses, including Carol's family and close friends, 
were called to share their insights into the case. Carol's husband, Mark, gave a moving testimony, describing the devastating impact of losing his wife and the shock of discovering the true nature of the relationship between Edna and Carol. He expressed the pain and sense of betrayal he felt upon learning the details of the affair and the murder. His testimony was an emotionally charged moment that demonstrated the pain and personal suffering caused by the tragedy. The jury had to deal with an emotionally complex and moving case. The decision to convict Edna involved considering her mental state, the premeditation of the crime, and the mitigating circumstances. After weeks of presenting evidence and testimony, the jury retired to deliberate. The deliberation process was tense and prolonged, reflecting the difficulty in finding a balance between justice and understanding the emotions involved. Finally, the verdict was announced. Edna was convicted of first-degree murder. The decision was met with a mix of relief and sadness by the community. The trial brought to light the devastating impact of betrayals and impulsive actions, but it also left a lasting mark on the town of Willow Creek. The case highlighted the fragility of human emotions and the extreme limits people can go to when faced with despair and fear. The consequences of the case extended beyond the trial. Carol's family, devastated by the loss, had to deal with the trauma and emotional pain. Mark and Carol's children struggled to rebuild their lives after the tragedy. Edna, in turn, faced an uncertain future, with her reputation ruined and her life destroyed by the desperate decision she made. The case also sparked a public debate about the effects of betrayal and emotional pressures, and how these forces can lead to extreme and violent behavior. Carol and Edna's story became a grim example of how desire, guilt, and fear can culminate in a brutal and devastating crime. The small town of Willow Creek would never be the same, marked by tragedy and revealed secrets that expose the depths of human nature. Carol's murder and Edna's subsequent trial not only shook the lives of those directly involved, but also had a profound impact on the Willow Creek community. The small town, known for its peaceful, cohesive appearance, was suddenly confronted with the stark reality that even the most peaceful environments can hide deep secrets and betrayals. The tragedy served as a catalyst for a series of reflections and changes in the way the community dealt with issues of morality, secrets, and mental health. The community's initial reaction was shock and disbelief. The residents of Willow Creek, who knew Carol as a devoted wife and caring mother, were perplexed by the revelations about her affair with Edna. The revelation that the crime was linked to a complex and emotionally charged betrayal only intensified the impact. Many residents struggled to reconcile Carol and Edna's public image with the grim reality that had been exposed. Local and national media outlets covered the case extensively, bringing to light intimate details of the private lives of those involved and exposing the tragedy to a wider audience. The media coverage, although often sensationalist, helped keep the case in the spotlight, but it also contributed to the suffering of Carol's family and the stigmatization of Edna. The constant exposure became an additional burden for everyone involved, adding to the already present stress and pain. For Carol's family, the pain of loss was exacerbated by the public nature of the case. Mark and his children have faced a painful grieving process, now accompanied by the need to deal with media attention and public judgment. The emotional and psychological impact was profound, and the family had to find ways to support each other as they dealt with the loss and betrayal that had devastated their lives. In addition to personal grief, the family had to face the stigma associated with Carol's death and connection with Edna, which made recovery even more difficult. Edna, in turn, faced not only legal condemnation, but also social condemnation. Public perception portrayed her as a treacherous and dangerous figure, and her once respected life was reduced to a series of fateful and regretful choices. The impact of the case on Edna's reputation was irreversible, and her life, now marked by infamy and regret, became a grim example of the cost of betrayal and despair. The case also led to a series of reflections on mental health and the impact of secrecy and emotional stress. Mental health experts and advocates have begun to highlight the importance of recognizing and treating mental health issues before they turn into devastating crises. 
Edna and Carol's story served as a warning about how extreme stress and guilt can lead to self-destructive and violent behavior. It was an opportunity for the community and society in general to reflect on the need for adequate emotional and psychological support and how secrets and social pressure can have devastating consequences. Local advocacy organizations and support groups began mobilizing to offer resources and support to those facing similar situations of stress and betrayal. There has been an increase in awareness about the importance of open communication and emotional support in relationships and families. The tragedy has led to a wider discussion about the way society deals with infidelity and the impact of emotional pressures, promoting greater understanding and empathy for those facing similar challenges. The Willow Creek community, while devastated by the tragedy, also became more cohesive as residents came together to support one another. The case served as a painful reminder that, behind facades of normality, there can be profound emotional and psychological complexity. The city has learned the importance of not making quick judgments and supporting community members who are struggling with personal and emotional issues. Ultimately, Carol and Edna's case not only left an indelible mark on the history of Willow Creek, but also served as a point of reflection for society on the complexities of human nature and the tragic consequences of unresolved secrets and betrayals. The story highlighted the importance of facing emotional issues head-on and offering appropriate support to prevent similar situations from turning into irreparable tragedies.